own that, own that. Right there. What's going on, movers and groovers? Welcome to MRI TV, the place to move, groove, and grow. And today we are reacting to 17 Snapshoot. If it's your first time on the channel, welcome. I appreciate you being here. If it's your third, fourth, fifth, millionth time on this channel, welcome back. I appreciate you watching all the videos, especially if you're watching the premieres or on the live streams. Shouts out to the stream squad, the patrons, especially those of you who are on the higher tier. Uh, I keep forgetting to put your name in the credits, so I'm sorry. I'm gonna remember it for this one. <laughs> and if uh, again, for you first first timers, if it's your, if you don't know who I am and I'm not Instagram famous or TikTok famous, I've been dancing for to over 20 years teaching, choreographing, directing for over 15. Helped co-found a co uh, competitive dance company called Family Business back in 2004. Toured with a professional hip-hop theater company called Antics. Worked with organizations such as Culture Shock, Mixed Elements, uh, Moving On Productions, and I currently direct a hip-hop entertainment company called Tamper Tantrum. Check out their channel because they also do uh, reaction videos as well, and obviously other dance content that I would love for you guys to check out. And anyways, going on to the whole phases, and I appreciate you guys because this, this whole month, uh, I'm just experimenting with different types of edits so we don't get any copyright issues. And sometimes I do have to resort to like cutting certain sections out, uh, which sucks. But I'm trying to like, I'm just trying to prevent it from getting blocked in general, whether it's partially blocked or blocked from the, the whole world. But anyways, uh, the part one is just me reacting to the video as it goes. Uh, very much like a sports commentator. They, I'm just trying to keep up with the action, just watching it as it is. Um, and that's why I kind of like talk over it. And also that's to the whole me talking over it is part of the whole transformative content uh, for fair use, which is why I talk over it. And uh, and I know some of you guys just like seeing the reactions um, as they go. Part two is where I get to put my choreographer director hat and I kind of like where I get to analyze and see every bit of the choreography. Um, albeit I don't know the vision or the intention of what they're trying to do because, you know, I'm not the choreographer. I'm not the label. I'm not the artists. But I do get to appreciate the artistry in their dance, uh, the things they may have called out that they improved on for the next rehearsal. Um, and uh, yeah, the, which leads next to the next part. And then the third part is the performance video where I get to see the whole, like a version of the vision come to life, wardrobe, lights, on stage with an audience. I think that's where, you know, the, the artist, many artists truly come to life because they are getting the energy from the fans and they're reciprocating it. Uh, there's nothing quite like it. And I, I'm, uh, you know, it's 2021 now, still locked down here in LA, but I'm looking forward to being able to share, to be on stage because seeing these guys perform is just freaking inspiring. So with that, let's head on to part one. Oh, it's from the third album, that's cool. That's cute. That's fun. This is fun. Hey. This is actually a bad thing to do and, and not a bad thing. Kind of an insult in the battle community. The use of the space and the vibe. Oh. That little flower effect right there, dude. The vibe. Woo! Da da da. <laughs> that was nice, man. <laughs> that, that sweater. That's a cute. This is that's that's a cute move. Easily duplicatable. From four fans, man. You, great use of the floor, great use of the spacing, great use of like energy, really like amplifying the song even more. Again, they're so good with their like with their vibe changes, man. <laughs> Hit him with the whoa. Nice. This that sweater is sick, man. <laughs> the fuck shirt. <laughs> this is fucking like 
chilling at the park with your homies, man. Barbecue. Ooh. Mmm. <laughs> That's a fun little visual. It's super easy, but like the fact that it's like staggering like that. I love how they're doing their own thing. And then they go to that. Hey. Something a little bit more groovy. That was fun. That was dope. Oh, what's happening here? Are they just hang hanging out? <laughs> this just reminds me of like the post credits of Ev Avengers. Um, super fun choreography. Um, a lot, very very cute. Like I think the that's the kind of stuff I think. Um, when I went when because what it just reminds me of is when I was in high school. Like we would have these super hardcore like badass in your moment. Uh, a choreography and then have a cutesy section because one the judges love it and the girls love it so we always ha did it because it was like you know we're trying to show how cool we are but also like oh look there's another side to us so this is like in a whole whole ass song to that just like the cutesy vibe like like i don't know like the the less badass kind of side um the, the use of the floor spacing always is, is always on point um when it, co it comes to the different vibes that they have I've always I'm coming to expect that every single time. Like they're owning like the really big, cool like movements, but then they're like switching it up to like, like to something like swaggy or something with more more groove based. So like the variety in their choreography, spacing, um, spacing, what do you call it? And even yeah, the the, the vibe of the choreography is you know it, it's it's always going to be like a mixed treat with them never just like a one t style kind of thing it's like there's always going to be a, a little bit nice little roller coaster of variety with them so that's it okay we're in a decent frame right 12 ish frame so it's going to look a little like but hopefully it still reads so let's go it's like a ring around the rosary Playful kids. Okay, I can't get enough. Can't get over his fucking sweater, man. It's the best. I remember that's a. I think if I remember correctly, that's a skate brand. That fucking run is. Fucking. It just gives me Scooby Doo vibes for some reason. I love the atmosphere. Just how they're just still in it. You can even you can still even see like how active their faces are. Whoa. That was a clever run into that formation and they I said I thought it was a random jump, but the jump led them into a triangle formation that led them to here. And then creating a separate group from the front and the back. Damn, that was slick as fuck, dude. And I just realized uh, I didn't create a layer. I like that acronym. <laughs> I just love these type of like weird moment choreography of like where you're just a table <laughs> or like just lean over like and you know, because it, it works as a visual whole, but if he was just an individual, like, just, you know, it just feel, I, I would feel weird. <laughs> and honestly, that was like, oh, I'm just going to, like, bend over and just chill. Oh, 
Oh my god, I fucking love this song. It's so, it's so like, hanging out in the park. Okay, I love this part. There's the flower. Oh, bam. Uh, yeah, we saw this. We saw this video as a reaction, Diego. Now we're just now we're analyzing it. So we're like we're breaking it down. <clears throat> Oof. Yeah. One, two, three, four. Boom, pulls it in. Boom, going around and around. Explodes out. Man, look how visual that is, man. And there's so many of them. Like, it doesn't really matter if they're off angle. It's just like, it's visual. It's like literally an explosion. Now, if it was a smaller group of people, you'd have to be very precise in, where, in arm placement because otherwise it feels really, really asymmetrical and off if you're trying to go for like the more balanced explosion look. So, I mean, look, I mean, look at the difference in the choreography right there. Like, there's, like, super, like, angular, hard, da, da. Then this one's fun and a little, little cute, groovy. Oh, my God. So clean, man. This moment, man. Oh my god. Watching these guys makes me feel like I'm uh, back in high school watching a really good competitive crew and shitting my pants because they're so good with their energy and their, their choreography. And I think someone here like... Right here. He's still kind of like in it even though he's not exactly the main guy. He's still has his energy going that's what i mean like even though you're not the main main star or the main focus you're still you still got to perform look at that look at that <laughs> he's kind of like <laughs> in this frame but he, he <laughs> he's still in it that is i like that a little like bounce with the knees makes me really wonder what they're gonna do with that that was a nice little rotation. That was a cute rotation. <laughs> I know this is supposed to be like a uh, super fun, but this just immediately makes it like PG-13. It's like, get fucked, son. Get fucked with this track, son. Again, and the, the, vi the vibe change is so quick and sharp with this. Look at that. Was that the scribble foot down there? Look at them right here. These two. The these two mirrors. Da -da 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 -da. Woo! <laughs> I can't believe that. <laughs> the, the, whoa. I, uh, the amount of TikTok dances I've seen in these K-pop videos is just like, what the fuck? <laughs> okay. Mm, own that. Own that. Right there. Yeah. Get that shit. <laughs> Love that. God, the choreography, man. Fuck, man. Just that simple fucking... Man, I would love to just be able to perform this. This is so feel good and fun. Okay, so I like the... the... 
the, the crazy chaos to create and do something organized. Do a two line. Stepping out. Slightly forward, but you know, I think we get the idea. So, and the, the simple like level changes of just the arms. Oof. Heck, uh, back with the aisles. <laughs> that was hard. God, this choreography is so fucking sick, dude. Like, the da 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 da. Like this part. That part. It's like a, like a little da 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 da. Just a little small quickness. I don't know why, like, I'm really, really fucking vibing with that. Just that moment with that piece of the choreo. Da 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 ba ba boom boom Woo! This is so fun man Damn that's great dude I love this fucking vibe It's great it's it's super fun to watch and I'd say like family friendly in a sense um, where it's super enjoyable, high energy. Uh, it doesn't feel forced. It, ge it feels like they're genuinely enjoying themselves with the choreography. And then the choreography isn't like corny. It's not choreography where it's like cool. Try to add really corny movements here. The choreography just still fucking goes off, and like uh, even the complementing the you know the different vibes like that they do. But um, yeah, like that one part like. Da, two, like one, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, eight, one, two. Ooh, that part is dope. Um, I don't know. I just like the groove and the quick, quick groove, groove. Bah, ooh, so dope. I like that kind of. I, I like it when people like can uh, with the when the choreography is interlaced with different uh, textures quickly because some people go like in too much like one, two, three, four, five, six. Or or like too much one and a two and a three and a four and like it's too much too uh, too fast. I like the nice little balance of like 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 and one and two and a three and four five like just nice little like appropriate switches and it, it felt natural. It didn't feel forced. It really what went like well and balanced with the song. So that's that. So that is it, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure you hit like, subscribe, share this with friends who you think might enjoy it. Uh, make sure you hit the notification bell so you guys are notified when the videos are premiering or even better when I'm live streaming and I can talk to you guys, you know, kind of have a little bit of a banter and that way it's not kind of a one-sided conversation like it is right now. <laughs> and you want to watch stuff beyond just the K-pop tutorials because I know you're here for that, but I do share other content as well. So <laughs> make sure to check out the podcasts I'm in, uh, my social media companies, uh, YouTube and podcasts, my dance companies, YouTube and podcasts because I'm, I have my hands in a whole bunch of other places uh, that I'm really passionate about. And I'm glad that, you know, out of all the things I'm creating that you guys are enjoying it. But, you know, feel free to check that stuff out too. And if you guys want to get, uh, just to plug, keep plugging stuff in here, if you guys want to get early access to everything that I'm releasing, especially this month, since it's re I'm doing a reaction month, um, I'm giving... I'm doing early access to everything um, as soon as it's done rendering uh, to everyone who's on the Patreon. So instead of having to wait like 13 days for an upcoming video, you'll get immediate access to it once I'm done editing it. So that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.